it gives you a place where you could actually uh, give yourself the time to think away from the hospital feeling. But George Marks is a, it's a beautiful place to actually uh, allow yourself that peace. When you ask me what is George Mark House, it's more family. Charlie loves it here. When he woke up this morning, he said, I get to go to my favorite place in the world today. I love the fact that Charlie can be, not only be cared for here to meet all of his physical needs and to give my husband and I a break from taking care of him, but that he developed a sense of trust in the fact that there are people in the world that can provide care and love and safety for him outside of his immediate family. And that for me is the biggest thing for Charlie is that he get a sense of community caring for him and that he's part of a greater community than just his family. son was near his death. Um, my husband and I wanted to get out of the, the hospital, that tiny room. We didn't really want him to die there. And miraculously, we were offered an opportunity to come to George Mark and bring our entire family um, and have our son pass away in, in a very family-friendly, serene environment. And I think I will forever be indebted to George Mark. Uh, because it also offers me a place to come back to to fill my son's spirit and um, stay connected with him. I don't think people really understand parents with children with disabilities, you really don't get a break. To be able to have a place where your child can go in, uh, this place is beautiful. Um, and, and just, I don't know, to take a little bit, sometimes the pressure off just takes the edge off things. It's just, it's, it's, a, it's a blessing. It's... it's nice to actually to have a place that you can go and drop your son off or your daughter and you can leave and when you leave, you don't look back because you know they are in a good place. Feel so are comfortable leaving them with somebody. Taken care of yeah. and you don't have to call every minute of the day to see how he's doing or they're doing because you know they're doing really good. And you finally get a break. You yeah. finally get a break. We've been doing this for, what, not, almost 12, 20 years now. And um, finally get a break. Oh. It's the place where my daughter passed away. It's a place where we could commit her into hands that were caring. When I couldn't be with her, I knew she was loved and cared for. It just met all the needs, medically, psychologically, emotionally, and for the whole family. It's like a dream. <laughs> it's really like a dream in the middle of a tough situation. It's, it was a haven. It was a peaceful place to come to 